Welcome to Work Smarter TV. I am Martin and in this video I will show you how to add headers and footers to your printed uh, Excel data. Um, if without anything we just go to print preview, no headers, no footers, and it looks like this. All right. Next page. Now let's say we want uh, your name to appear at the top and let's say a page number at the bottom let's do that that's what that will be fun we go to page layout click this one and we go to header and footer now in the footer we can say uh, if i said we wanted to do the page number page one of a question mark and it will as you can see page one of one and this will update obviously one to five and in the header, I can have, a, this is the file name. Yeah, I should rename this actually. With, you can see it here as well. This is how you download it from uh, the European Union Statistics Bureau. Well, all kinds of stuff. Ah, this would be nice, prepared by MH. Those are my initials, a date, page one. But I want something else. I'm gonna create a custom header. Now, in this, uh, menu we have three options the left section the center section the right section I don't think I have to tell you what those mean and I can say okay I want a picture here in the right section uh, I want a date well the date's nice let's say I want to insert a date here you can see this is a uh, formula so this will automatically update uh, when you print you can insert a page number but we already have that in the footer so no need insert the number of pages that's the, you can say one of five. Uh, and I can even insert the time. Yeah, that's nice. And file path, like where is this file located on my computer? That can be quite handy to include. Uh, file name, sheet name. The file name is this horrendous <laughs> string of digits. Um, the sheet name obviously are, is this one, the sheet one, zero, sheet two, but you can make up any fancy names you want. And a picture, well, you could insert your company logo. But for now, I'm just going to just insert here. Work smarter, smarter TV. All right. Click OK. We click OK again. And we go to, because you don't see, this doesn't change anything in your data. This is just about printing. So I click Print Preview. And now you can see here we have the date. It's 16, 16 February today. And it's... 10.36 and here we have the work smarter TV I just typed it in and this is page 105 and let's see if we can make this a bit bigger I must be a bit bolder with my brand don't you think so we go to custom header and we can let's see yeah here we can say I want to have it now this suddenly shows up in Dutch interesting anyway that is bold <laughs> And we make it 12 and let's make it blue. And you can see it here in the preview and here in the print preview as well. Now, that doesn't that look nice? All right. Um, thank you for uh, thank you for watching. I hope you found this video helpful. If you have any questions, you can leave them in the comments. You can also subscribe to my YouTube channel by clicking the button above the video. And if you want to get email updates uh, when I post a new video and uh, get tips and tricks on how to better use Microsoft Excel, you can click the button in the uh, right below corner. It will take you to my website worksmarter.tv and you can subscribe to my mailing list there. Thank you for watching. See you next time. Bye bye.